In this video, I want to create a link from a lead that we created in the last app video to a buyer that I created. In this video, I, between the two videos, I created a new app called Buyers. It's very simple. I have one buyer set up. Let's come in here. I just create contact, target areas, which are the counties, set it to multi select, and then a notes field. You can modify this template and modify any app template by clicking once you're in it modify template you can add remove other count other items at any time it makes it cool because sometimes you're in a screen and you need a new field because you want to record some information you can just modify bring this in here new field hit done and now you can add more info and this is now available to every item in this app. So it's automatically saved. There we go. So now what we want to do is create a relationship or a link between a lead. So we get a lead in. And we know that Chris is interested in this property. So you see we don't have a relationship field set up. So we can go do the modify template grab a relationship, drag it all the way down to the bottom. Now we have to select the app that we want to use. Since we only have one other app, well, this shows all the apps in the different workspaces, but you want to make sure you select the app from the current workspace, which is Tutorial, so the Buyers app. You can actually create multiple links to different, re different apps. You only want one, so let's save. Click done. And now scroll all the way down. Relationship. It's already linked to the buyers app. Here's a buyer Chris. If you had multiple buyers, you would see multiple ones. You can also create here to add a new item, which is creating adding a new buyer. So we'll just add Chris. Oops, sorry, clicking the wrong thing. Now Chris is associated with this lead, which is very cool because it also goes in here. We go into the Buyers app, click on Chris, come down here, and now that property is also visible if you click on Chris. So if Chris, you have Chris linked to many, many properties, four, five, six, they will all show up under here, and then you can just go in and click and open up the property that you want to see. But it's a great way to see what kind of properties Chris likes, his history, and same thing for the leads. It's a great way to, to quickly see which uh, buyers are, uh, are would be interested. Now in my app that I've set up, I have a, a Globiflow uh, workflow set up that automatically finds the buyers and adds the relationships for me as soon as the lead gets imported into my system, which saves me some steps. That is a whole nother video, just an example of the coolness of Podio. And also over here you can see that the event was triggered to say recorded that I added the relationship to Chris. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. This could get a little confusing. It could get very complicated as you go deeper and relate different apps, different app items, multiple app items. So it can get like three, four dimensional. So keep it simple, one app to one item, then you should be all right.